have to edit this. That's <laughs> okay. all going up. Right. When you're doing the buzz, think Im impulse. So the word impulse, so Im and pulse will be that. Im Like you're blowing a raspberry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, look. Oh, so you think like you're blowing a raspberry? Yeah, you know, you don't worry about. Oh. down and you twist a little bit. Yeah, okay. Put the hand in the bell. That way you got a the boy. You put your your thumb on the side of your hand. Mm -hmm. uh, yep. And then there's a slight curve. Let me see. Yeah 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 like you're waving. Yeah yeah that was <laughs> good. That was good. <laughs> then you put it yeah right there. So when you when you put it think this this right here, so this has to be supporting the instrument. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And then your pinky goes, yeah, right there. Whenever, whenever you're putting your fingers down, don't feel it like that. You want your fingertips, yeah. Because mm. when you get long fingers and then you take too long to like press down the notes mm -hmm. or the valves. Your thumb can just sit on here. Doesn't really have to press it yet. Not until that A. The A. Yeah. Okay. All right. Should I hold it like Yeah, this? hold it up. Like you're gonna play. This is fine. Yeah. Don't play it though. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's fine. Can you rest it on my leg? Or yeah, yeah, that's fine. It's either one. You can either like have it up, or you can like got it. Have it on your on your thigh. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. So, how do you finger that? Uh, one. One. Yeah. How do you finger the G? Yeah. Yeah. Trick question. How do you finger the A? One, two. Show me at the same time. Yeah, all right. So finger along, F, G, A. All right. Wait, wait, don't play it. You got finger along to the notes. Mm. All right. So do you remember how to play? Yes. The rads are in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. just so it can help you to like hit the notes easier easier mm -hmm. you know faster faster air let's start on that a Tubes? 
Sure. So, French horn is made. See, like, this is the uh, F side right here. So these first three, the ones on top, is the F. Mm -hmm. These bottom three are the B flat. So you see, uno, dos, tres. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. And then whenever you play, whenever you press down to the trigger, so normally it's an F without the trigger being pressed, so it just goes like through this tube right here, goes in through here, through here, and then see this tube right here? That's the B flat tube, and whenever you press this down, it goes into this side instead of going straight into this side. So it's kind of it's kind of confusing because of how the airflow goes, but after a while, like how long I've been playing, you kind of know the tendencies of how the horn's going to be or how it's going to sound. It's just pulled out. Yeah, it is. That's why it's all like. Oh, it's not even greasy. Maybe that's some grease. <laughs> some grease. But once you know like how the airflow goes, you know which notes they're gonna be like sharp or flat. So depending on what they are, you switch between the B and the F, and the F. So that's why like sometimes like when you play the A with the trigger, mm -hmm. it's better to play with the trigger because when you play without the trigger, it's it's a uh, it sounds flat. Hmm. So that's some technical. Can I try it? Yeah, you can try it. So uh, play the A without the trigger first, or with the trigger. I mean. <laughs> So it just won't, at, one, at to a point, it just won't start playing with the trigger, so you're going to have to switch back to the F. Interesting. So are there so many alternative things? <laughs> Sick. <laughs> 